Hi everyone. Today we present you with our weekly technical insights on model creation. So, uh, how to import Polygon in Model Builder, right? In InfraWorks Civil, using by using Civil 3D. So, if you haven't watched the previous week, weekly technical insight video on Civil 3D and InfraWorks both, so I suggest you uh, watch first, continue to do it. So Capricot Technology is a win zero company and partner of choice for AC industry is a, one of the biggest platinum partner for Autodex and Bentley along with authorized training centers. So we have 300 plus dedicated team members with clientele over 20,000 in AC and associate industries. So let me introduce myself. My name is Shubham Vani uh, as a solution specialist civil 3D at Capricot Technologies, New Delhi. So we'll present you with our weekly technical insights. So, uh, creating a polygon shape uh, file in InfraWorks can be tedious uh, process and leading with uh, inefficiency in project development, right? So, the time consuming and manual creation of polygon hampers its productivity and delay in project timelines. So, streamline the workflow by leveraging the power of Civil 3D, generating a polygon shape file dot SHP is uh, effortlessly and uh, effectively uh, by using uh, Civil 3D, right? So in that uh, way, uh, with uh, InfraWorks Model Builder, you can import your um, polygon seamlessly into our InfraWorks projects. So simplifying your workflow uh, and that save time and accurately uh, accelerate the project development uh, in eff efficient solution. So in these insights, um, in this technical insight, shall be uh, while focusing the how to create a map polygon in uh, in Civil 3D. So next to be how to export the shape file in, in Civil 3D. And then moving forward to be uh, discussing how to import uh, map polygon and in InfraWorks for uh, creation of existing uh, model surface. Right. So let's jump into Civil 3D. So. Uh, I have one file. Uh, I'll just name over here dot shape file model creation and I'll just going under the setting. I'll just defining over here some coordinates. I'll just capturing the surface T4 dash 43 and I'll just hit over over here. Okay. Then now uh, I'll just on the map hybrid for locating our uh, map. Right. So I'll just capturing existing cons uh, conditions from uh, New Delhi, right? So I'll just look at it over here, some area. Just defining. New Delhi. So I'll just look at it, the area over here, and then I'll just uh, simply, I'll just fix a layering over here. I'll just see zero. Then I'll just color over here the red. Then I'll just command over here M polygon, right? Just enter over here and just locate the area we want to locate in InfraWorks, right? So I'll just define defining over here. Area. So I'll just close over here. That's polygon, right? So you can see, you can see over here, uh, this polygon has been created, right? So if you want to edit those polygon lines by using some command, you can edit, right? So for that, I'll just exporting the com uh, map. You can export map command. You can just map export right over here. Just enter. Then you have to define, define the data whether you have I'll just name over here and file tab as a issue shape file. Just click on OK. Then you have to select polygon, select manually. I'll just selecting one polygon over here, right? He's, uh, he's indicating me select object one are found. I'll just enter over here. You can now see one object has been selected. 
I'll just click over here to export the shape file, right? So for that, so shape file is successfully created. I'll just jump into InfraWorks, click over here as a model builder, right? Then going under the import polygon from here, I'll just shift it view into Arial. Just click on import polygon and select your shape file, right? I'll just defining both file, click on open. So now you can see the polygon shape has been successfully imported over here. Just click on model name, description, coordinate system, and you can create your own uh, by using create model, right? So that's it. I hope you guys had insightful session. Uh, do subscribe our YouTube channel for all updates. We will be delighted from here you uh, do reach out to us for any suggestions, query or topic we want to be discussed. See you next week. Thanks and take care.